Officials from Iran will meet with six major powers in Vienna today. They'll discuss the landmark interim nuclear agreement. It allows UN inspectors inside plants suspected of being part of the country's nuclear program. One plant was inspected Sunday. Elizabeth Palmer is in Tehran with the results. The Geneva Agreement on Iran's nuclear program passed its first test this weekend when the Iranian authorities allowed two international inspectors into a nuclear facility near the capital, Tehran, which had been off limits for more than the past two years. The Iranian government points to this as proof that the deal is working, can work, but it's very early days yet, of course. And they're very much afraid that a new round of sanctions coming out of the U.S. Senate will derail it before it has time to build trust between Iran and the international community. It has to be said that the deal is not universally popular here in Iran either. In fact, President Rouhani's government is facing a lot of resistance from the hardliners here who see the deal as a sellout to the West. And in some ways, they would like nothing better than a new round of U.S. sanctions making the deal fail before it can really get traction. For CBS This Morning, I'm Elizabeth Palmer in Tehran.